Hi, it's Larry here of Xbox Live's Major Nelson here with Aaron Greenberg from uh, Xbox. Aaron, great to see you. It's good to be here, Larry. Thank you. A lot of Quantum Break news dropped today. Can you summarize it real quickly and then we'll, we'll get right into it? Well, we do have a lot of news. I mean, first, we're just months away from the release of Quantum Break on April 5th. We've got uh, kind of our first look at the title. We've got a brand new spot that we're releasing today. We've got uh, some press previews that are coming out. We brought a group of media out to see the game. We've got a brand new limited edition Quantum Break bundle. And we've got some exciting news for Windows 10 fans as well. Now you're also doing something beyond the video game. There's also this, this other component. Let's, let's talk about that. So the game, uh, play you play as a hero in the game. So you play as Jack Joyce, uh, who uh, we're really fortunate to get to work with, Sean Ashmore. People know him from uh, the X-Men. Uh, and so he's the lead character. You play as the hero. But there is this evil corporation, Monarch, and uh, when you go, when you finish uh, an act, and then you'll go into and actually be able to watch a TV show type experience that built on what you just played through. You know, we've got a great cast of folks from people that you may have seen in Game of Thrones or The Wire, and, and so that's where you go and see the other side. So you see kind of it from the side of the villains. And so what's really neat about just how a movie is told or how a TV show might be made, they're applying the same type of dynamic in creating this, this story uh, in Quantum Break, is that you get to both play as a hero but also see it from the other side, which for me as a gamer is uh, something I've never seen before. Aaron, there was also a great ad that dropped this week as well. Let's talk about that. Yes, we have been working on something that's really unique. I think gives people a sense of what the game is going to be like. Uh, it's a live action piece that features Sean Ashmore. Uh, the ad's called uh, The Cemetery. And uh, it gives you a little bit of sense of uh, time stutters and being able to control and manipulate time and how that can change the outcome of the game. And we'd love to hear what fans think of it. Tell us about the limited edition hardware bundle for Quantum Break. So the limited edition bundle comes in a very special Cirrus White 500 gigabyte console. So you get the X, the white Xbox One and a white controller, plus you get Quantum Break uh, at no additional cost as part as a digital download. What we want to be able to do is for folks that do buy Quantum Break, we want to be able to allow them to get some extra bonus content. So first, they'll get uh, Alan Wake uh, for via backward compatibility. Uh, whether they buy it in the bundle or they buy it as a standalone game, we've also included both the downloadable content that came with Alan Wake. So they'll get the, the writer and the signal, uh, which were great uh, DLCs as part of that package. Aaron, there's also another exciting pre-order available as well, right? There is. We've included tons of great content for folks that do buy and pre-order Quantum Break, uh, both at participating retailers, as well as digitally through our Xbox store. You will, in addition to everything I mentioned, we're also now including American Nightmare, which was a great Alan Wake uh, Xbox Live Arcade standalone title that uh, many fans may or may not have played, but we think will be a great bonus for them. Now also in here is we have the Windows 10 version. We do, and so, you know, Remedy has a deep history of bringing their titles uh, to the PC, and so we're excited to let, uh, you know, gamers, no matter if they're primarily on the console or play on the PC or they play on both, to experience Quantum Break. Uh, so we will be launching it on April 5th. Um, it is available for pre-order uh, today on Xbox One. Uh, but in addition to that, if you play the game on Xbox One or you play the game on Windows 10, your saves will be synced from one version to the other. I want to point out something really important though, because it's, it's, this is critical for folks, is that if you purchase the Xbox One version for a specific amount of time, you're going to get the Windows 10 version at no cost. That is true. So one of the things we were able to do, this is something uh, specific to our Xbox store. So if you buy the title digitally and you pre-order it uh, through your Xbox One, you'll also get the Windows 10 version for free only during that pre-order period. And it's something we really were trying out. We want to let our fans be able to experience. But we said, listen, hey, we know we're bringing this, uh, this title both to Xbox One and Windows 10. So why not just give you the Windows 10 version for free, let you continue and play. If you're at home in the living room, you play through the first act, great. You may be at work or you may be on the road and you want to continue, pick up where you left off. It'll automatically allow you to do that. Your controllers also work, by the way, which is great. Uh, or if you want to play the keyboard or mouse, you can do that as well. So we're excited to be able to give gamers the flexibility to play Quantum Break no matter where they are. And that all happens April 5th. Aaron Greenberg from Xbox Marketing. Thank you, Aaron. No one saw it coming. We never thought time itself could collapse and take the world down with it.
for granted. Just like I took you for granted. We've got a visual on choice. Confirm target. Guns hot. But if I get another chance, I'll make sure things are 